What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Flicking on My Big Tarot here, where I bring you the beauty, juicy, spiritual truths. I'm your spirit guide host, Miss BC. As you all know, you do not have to believe in tarot. Do not excuse yourself from the message because this shit can actually happen. Capricorn, all of my information will be in the description box below. Please be sure to like, share, and subscribe to this video. If this is so, drop a tip in my cash app, leave a comment, let me know. I'm also conducting personal readings as well. The email for that will also be in the description box below. Happy birthday, happy solar day, happy spiritual day to all of the Capricorns. It's Capricorn season and it is the season for work. It is the season for discipline. It is the season for getting shit done, okay? Let's see what your message is right now. Hand of cards. Okay, take a chance, risk being strategic, options not showing your hand. So this is really good for Capricorn. And I say that because Capricorns are natural born, take it to the grave people. They will never show you their hand. They will always make sure that they're two steps ahead of you, much like the Aquarius. However, Capricorns are ruled by the planet of Saturn, which is very, very, very disciplined. And this is the father. This is a very much uh, masculine sign. Uh, it's supposed to be uh, a masculine sign. But of course, unfortunately, our men are not showing that to us these days. They come with a lot of feminine qualities. However, that's a whole nother show. Now, right now, I feel like somebody is taking a chance taking a risk and they have cards in their hand, but they are not showing them. So you know that they're playing a game. You just don't know how they're playing a game right now. And this could be in money. This could be in relationships. This could be in a family dynamic, marriage. Let's see what else we have. You all may be playing cards right now literally playing cards uno solitary spades bridge if y'all still play that uno oh sabotage okay so either somebody is trying to strategically sabotage you or you are doing this I feel like you're playing a game and your game is to break something and rebuild it the way you want it to be built. Unfortunately, Capricorns do have a problem with self-sabotage, much again like the Aquarius. This is not the Aquarius reading, but this is very much, uh, we Aquarius share some of the same traits and I have a lot of Capricorn in my chart. So I see a lot of this in myself. You could be dealing with an Aquarius, but I feel like you're you're taking a risk and you want to break something and rebuild it, but you want it structured and architected your way. Hmm. Part with the key. Okay, so a relationship. Okay. So you are strategically trying to break somebody down and rebuild them up. But this is somebody that I feel like you have a liking for. This is somebody that you feel like is close to your heart. Capricorns do not allow everybody in. They may talk to everybody, but Capricorns do not allow everybody into their circle. They don't allow everybody... You know, if they're comfortable with you, yes. However, they can have a whole family, a whole Instagram, and you still not really know anything about what goes on within their family. It'll look, it'll be a picture perfect take. And you won't even know that all of them just literally fist fall at each other before taking that picture. You would never know what's going on. So I feel like this is a relationship that you're involving yourself in with some with someone but you're strategically trying to mold it into what you want it to be. See, I think you see yourself in somebody and you like it. 
I think you see, I, I think, but it's like self-sabotage because you know how you are. However, you may be trying to, again, better yourself or better them. So it's like, I see a lot of me in them and, oh, look at that. Somebody's wearing a fake mask, not showing their true feelings. Hiding how they feel towards someone else. Okay, so again, I think that you may believe that somebody is putting on a front or maybe you're putting on a front. And I feel like this is a situation where you want to break somebody and rebuild them to where you want them to be. This is kind of one of those situations. This is kind of like a Virgo characteristic. And Virgos are earth signs. Now, Virgos are the type of people that they they deal with partners who they can mold into what they feel that they should be. Usually, they want them to be the better versions of themselves. However, what Virgos fail to realize is that everybody is their own individual person and you can't change and mold them. However, Virgos have the ability to manipulate people in a particular way to mold them into what they want. And this is somewhat of a Capricorn chart that the earth signs share amongst each other. This is one of those things because Capricorns are generally the individuals who, you know, they're the ones that are very disciplined. They're the ones everybody want because they're disciplined, because they're hardworking, because they have it together. However, they have a very much uh, slightly cynical way of going about it. You hear that fire alarm in the back, the police alarm in the back? Somebody is giving the bare minimum in this situation. It's like, I feel like somebody is being very childish. Somebody in this situation is um, given the least amount of work or the least amount of opportunity. I think the strategy is, um, the strategy of whoever if this is you or this is the person that you may be dealing with. And this doesn't necessarily have to be romantic, but when I see heart with the key, I think it is. This is a situation, Capricorn, where somebody is given the least amount. Somebody may be very childish. This is why they're being strategic and trying to break something. It's kind of like, I want my way. I like you, but I want my way. So I'm going to break you down and try to mold you to be what I want you to be without giving the most, without giving you all that I have, right? A tower moment. Now, this is a type of situation where I, I really do feel like Capricorn, that somebody means well. However, they're not going about it the right way. Somebody right now is trying to they're, they're, I feel like they don't want to self-sabotage, but this is a little difficult for them to do because it's like naturally, terror. it's like naturally I'm strategic. Naturally, I like to break things and rebuild them naturally, but there's a double-edged sword because even with you doing something, you know, even with you doing something with the best intent, it may not always come off like that to the opposite individual. So you may be trying to resist breaking someone or self-sabotaging, but I think it's going to be very hard for you to do because you're not giving the most. And somebody, like I said, is being childish, but it's kind of one of those situations where I feel like somebody don't really want to be like that. And see, they're going to communicate this to you. They're going to show you with their actions. Like somebody may communicate or you may communicate to somebody that, you know, you're welcoming love or you're opening your heart, you're getting to know them, but little do they know that you're, you have a strategy or you, there's, there's something here. You have a strategy or you're trying to do you. There's a reason, there's a method to your madness. See, you're unfulfilled with someone. 
you're unfulfilled with them, you're not happy about what it is that you see with somebody. There's somebody that you're dealing with that you're not happy about what you see. Now, again, this could be somebody that you really, really like or somebody that you really care about, but you're unfulfilled with them. And it's like, I feel like you don't want to break the relationship. However, you may strategically be trying to, either you are trying to break this off or they are. It's like you don't want to sabotage this. However, you, it's like something may be wrong with this individual that you maybe you don't feel like you can fix. So it's like, is it worth it? Like, I just feel like somebody is playing a game. This is the overall message. Somebody is playing a game. You are involved with someone and whoever this person is, uh, this is somebody that you genuinely like or care for. You may want love with or feel like you want love with. You're getting together with somebody. You They feel perfect. However, there's certain things about them that you see that you don't like. And because of that, you're strategically going to formulate a plan on breaking them down and slowly rebuilding them. However, the strategy is give them the least amount, break them down slowly, but it's kind of like, damn, I feel bad about doing it because I know that this person means well. Well, Capricorn, you have a decision to make. If you don't, she better. 